Right, this is my CCM SR40 400cc motorcycle. It's got the Suzuki DRZ 400 engine in it. It's a 400E version, which has got the Keyhin flat slide carburetor. Um, but unlike the normal 400E engines, it's got an alternator. It's the Australian version. the mileage on the clock. You see there's an extra there, there's a, a little gauge there to measure the charge which I've fitted um, on used to old classic bikes with, with amateurs on them so I'd like to see that they're charging properly. It's a nice sculpted alloy tank. Coming around the back. The carrier there is something I've fitted, it's just something I've got off eBay, I don't know what it's off, you'll see it's held at the back with Jubilee clips, but it's bolted using the bolts holding the seat in, the battery uh, compartments under the seat. Come round and show what I think is just about the only blemish on the bike apart from all the wear and tear, and that's that there is a split, slight split that was on the bike when I got it, and the side panel there. Um, charging is fine. Um, I keep it on a trickle charge. Uh, so while the bike hasn't been used for several months, it's been on a constant trickle charge. So it started first thing this afternoon. You see it's got aftermarket rear footrests. They're chopped down because they're not standard on the bike. The reason they're chopped down is because if you don't the uh, long side stand there is fouled by them and you can't get the side stand up. So um, they therefore need to be chopped down but they work fine. 
I've never heard of a better idea for that. Switch the petrol off. See the carburetor there. And that's it.